YouTube, what is good job? I've been out here for like 10 minutes trying to just get myself in a headspace to make this fucking video. I used to make videos two or three times a week, now they're scarce out. This shit is a process now. This shit is a process now. That's some real shit. But fucking, um, finally reached 1K, y'all. We finally reached 1K. This would be such a great fucking moment if that shit didn't take three years to do. You feel me? It's, it's all good though. The plan when I started my channel was never to get big. I was never, I never started my channel like, oh, I'm gonna have a million subs. I'm gonna have 500,000 subs. I just started my channel because I've seen, I love WeTube. I've seen videos like, I can do this shit better. I wouldn't, I wouldn't take five minutes to start smoking. I wouldn't do this. I'm like, let me fucking do it then. Here we are. What's good, y'all? <laughs> but, um, I mean, all right, let's hit this, y'all. Let's fucking hit this. Because when I try to make videos and I talk before I smoke, I just babble, ramble. So let's hit this, y'all. You got some super cookies in the sovereignty. Which is dirty, you're not gonna see that. <laughs> but um, let's hit this, 0.5. Get my hair out of the flame, you feel me? plan was to never get big with this shit. That was never really my goal. I just wanted to make good content. I wanted to have a channel that people could come to to like see smoking videos, you know? I just wanted to make good content. My plan was to never be the biggest YouTuber, be the biggest this, be the biggest that. But y'all do tell me y'all be fucking with my videos. I mean, in my old videos, y'all have to tell me I used to fuck with them shits. I went back to watch some of my old videos the other day, and I was like, yeah, I was, you know how people are on YouTube, and they're like, oh, I can't watch myself, it's so cringe, I hate watching myself, that's how I feel now, but back when I was making videos, like, every three days, every four days, just out, 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 I could literally sit there and watch, my videos used to be fucking fire, boy, I could sit there and watch my video, like, <coughs> <coughs> pardon me, I'm a little sick, y'all, I was sick, I still got a little cough, not the corona, not the corona, don't worry. But, um, I was watching a video like, yo, my videos used to be fucking lit. I had to make a video about that. The next bowl I pack is going to be a moke. The reason why I wanted to pack a moke, I wanted to hit the moke first. <coughs> but, um, the reason why is because I'd be sitting back here wanting to make a video but I'm just not in the headspace to do that shit. And like, I'd be like, fuck it, I'm gonna just smoke and have a regular smoke session. I would smoke, I would hit a moke. <coughs> I'm sick. And fucking, um, just the video would come to me. Like, I would I would be talking to myself, how I would talk to the camera. I'm like, yo, let me turn the camera on. I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna just talk and not smoke. You feel me? Like, what the fuck? So I'm like, next time, next time, next time. Next thing you know, 10 days pass. Let me pack up this next bowl. <coughs> I'm actually gonna pause the video and pack this bowl. So y'all don't gotta see me cough and just see the dead dead air. Feel me? Hold on one second. I'm letting y'all know right now. I do not wanna take the smoke. I'm fucking clapped. I'm fucking high. But we gonna be alright. We're gonna be alright. You know, I used to fucking tell myself that when I was young, when I was real young. Fucking now I'd be scared to like say I was like playing my PS3 like late at night and I was fucking um scared to walk in the basement to my fucking attic and shit and I was young. I would fucking I would just tell myself, I'd be like, what's really gonna happen? I'm gonna I'm gonna go upstairs, I'm gonna go in bed, I'm gonna go to sleep, I'm gonna wake up tomorrow. Like not like what's really gonna happen? And I was be like, alright, just go walk upstairs. Like <laughs> God, God think of shit like that, like this shit, no one ever die from smoking fucking bug. This is butter and tobacco, but I don't think I'm gonna die. What's, what's really gonna happen? I'm gonna make the video. I'm gonna love it. I'm gonna fucking go inside. No, I'm feeling. No, no, I'm feeling. No, I'm saying. <laughs> no, I'm feeling. No, I'm feeling right now. You feel me? You know what I'm feeling? 
Imagine we said that to each other. You know what I'm feeling? Say some next shit like, yo, fucking tight. Fuck this nigga. You know what I'm feeling? Nah, nah. <laughs> it wouldn't work. It wouldn't work. <coughs> but let me hit this, yo. You know what's crazy? I be having to take multiple hits when I take, multiple hits, multiple takes when I take videos. Not this time, but I be having to literally take multiple takes. Never had to do that before, son. Is hitting. Fuck. That mocha is smacking. Shit. Smoke on camera. Y'all be wanting to see him. I didn't take the mocha first because I be slurring my words when I talk when I take mocha. So I'm like, let me take that last. I want to talk about this man Floyd, son. This man Floyd, disrespectful boy. No one, I'm gonna explain. I'm gonna explain this. No one in the history of boxing has had Floyd's skill set. No one in the history of fucking boxing has ever had a skill set. Now, you gotta listen now. There's two points I wanna make. You can bring up Sugar Ray Robinson. He's number two. But fucking, it's like, Boxers from back then, they reached their height. Boxers in history in general, they reached their height, and that's their fucking height. That's where they got. That's their prime. That's where they got in the end of their career. That's where they got, right? So new boxers, say Floyd, when he say he's like nine years old, he's watching old tapes of their prime. That's where he's starting. You know what I'm saying? Now, I'm, that's for all new, that's for all current boxers. But that's where they're starting. They're starting from their prime, learning that when they're young. You know what I'm saying? So, like, it's like you gotta give them their respect, the fucking boxers in history. But you gotta also, you gotta be logical with shit, you feel me? Fucking, um, that point I wanna make. And fucking, just, he's, I call it, I call it know how. The way he boxes, I call it no how because he changed the sport of boxing. People box like him now. He he definitely changed the sport. Let's give him that. I'm I'm gonna say that off the bat. Fucking um But the way he learned boxing, it's it's really he 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 used to say this. It's really true. He was everyone's dealt a hand. Fucking you you don't give yourself a hand, the dealer deals you a hand. He was dealt the royal flush. That's a fact. Cause fucking, just the Grand Rapids, where he came from. That's not like a fucking. It's like the hood, you feel me? But it's like the way his father and his uncle explained boxing to him. They weren't technical with it. They were talking like in slang, like, "Oh, do this. Oh, when he does that, do that." And Floyd's like, he's young, like, "I right, bet." Boom, 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 boom. He's not learning like, "Oh, block, check, check, hook, right hand." He's not learning like that. He's like, "Throw this." When he does that, do that, that. So you can do this, that, like, he's just learning. He's just, it's like second nature to him. It's not taught to him. He's just, like, you know what I'm saying? Like that, like, I call that know-how. Like, when he boxes, he's not, he, he not, he's not thinking, like, like, I'm going to throw, he just, he goes off of what they do, but he knows how to counter any, everything, whatever they fucking do, because he just, it's, it's so, it's not hard to explain. I'm just fucking high right now, son. I hope y'all I hope y'all are following me, son. There's an ant crawling on my fucking phone. Don't crawl on the camera, my guy. <laughs> Fuck off the phone, son. Fucking, um... But yeah, no one has had his skill set in the history of boxing. And box... Bro, Julio Cesar Chavez Sr., who just boxed, like, last weekend, this man went 86-0. and 86-0. and And no one has had Floyd's skill set in the history of boxing. He wants to stop at 50. This man is disrespecting me, son. He's disrespecting me, boy. This man, fuck legacy, right? Fuck legacy? Come on, my guy. Like, it's not all about the money, son. You got the money. It's like, 
money is a game, boy. Like, it's really a trick. Like, you, he has, he's a billionaire. He has money. It's, like, you have it, now what? You just get more. Like, money is a trick. Money is a trick. It's really a trick. Like, as much as you have, you can still get more. You're going to, it's crazy, boy. But, um, Floyd disrespected me. Fucking not boxing. Not going 100 and no, He's really disrespecting me, boy. But, um, I'm going to have to deal with it, boy. I'm out. Peace out. Thank you.